Yes, 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 what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the kingdom. So today I thought, we'll just do it different. I'm always on the move. I'm always doing this and doing that. So I thought I'd do a bit more of a day in life, what I do, what I get up to, and give you a little bit more insight. What I've got on today, I've got to start off my morning. My guy, Matty General, comes true, and we get to cleaning. So I've got to sort out Dell's kennel. Look what he's done to his water bowl. Absolutely battered his water bowl. What's happening, mate? What's happening? All right, cool. So yeah, we're gonna get to the cleaning and I don't know what's happening, so let's just do this thing. I've just got to get all this guy's shit up. <laughs> hey, so let's disinfect the kennels now. All the disinfectant from Animal Prime and from LDN Canine Clinic, so hit them lot up. So this is the sage wash now. It covers for a lot of stuff like parvo virus, all of them things there. So yeah, that's Dell's Bay done, yeah? That's a bull herder, Dell, yeah? Let me get on to Bine, yeah? Let me show how clean his is, yeah? This is a herder. Look at Bine's kennel, bro. The brother, the brother's cleaner. So it's germicidal disinfectant, yeah? And we'll get a bit of lavender scent on that as well. I've got to go back now and wash out Dells. By the time I wash out Dells, I should be able to wash out um, Bynes. Go on. So, yeah, you. Go on. Give him a little wash there. So what I'll do now, I'm gonna bring him out for a walk. Let him walk that off. Come back and crack on with the rest of the day. We've got to check on the snakes for the morning. Yeah, man, we'll just see how the day goes. I ain't even got my phone on me, so I can't tell you what we're doing. And yeah, let's get on with it. Let's do this. Bring him Bine out now for his walk. And then, yeah, just get into the rest of the day. So come on, Bine. Right now, I'm just letting him do his little thing. He's just happy to be out. Good boy. Come then. Uh -huh. What I'm going to start doing, I say the next couple of weeks, I'm going to start patterning up a bit more of his positioning because he's just a ball of excitement right now. But right now, I'm just more concerned about it. I just want him to burn a little energy and just have a good time, really, bruv. So that's buying. He's gone for his walk. What I'm going to do, go inside, give him a bone, and then um, crack on with the rest of the day. So let's get back indoors. And yeah, let's get back to the dogs. Let's go. That's yours, mate. <laughs> Come with the snakes, yo. LR supplies. Make sure you lot follow these guys for your supplies. All right, cool. So I've got to check on this female. All right, he's there and she's in the back there. She's there. She's there. The male's in the back there. So that needs to come out. She's there. She's right here. She's cool. She's cool. Looking all bumpy in that. I reckon she's going to lay soon. Cool. Well, let me just check on the eggs quickly while we're here. Everything seems okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got the catty out. So I've been doing some training with her. Give her a little cardio today, doing some runs. Go on, girl. And at the same time, getting her past in strong, keeping her up in the air like that. But I don't want her jumping. So this is first pick, Enzo. Cross Bossy Valentina. She's more of a heavy set dog, so she's a lot more slower than Del. Them dogs there, but it's still good to just get her out here. Look at her. Yes. She's already had her morning walk. She went out with Matty G for the morning. Look at the, look at the stack. That's it. So I put that away. Just let her have a little bit of time out with us. Look at my, are you going to eat my phone? Good girl. We got a lamb neck for her. I'm going to put her away, give her a lamb neck. And let's crack on with the rest of the day, yeah? Imagine I've been going around looking for a jacket potato. <laughs> Mate, it's like the demons are coming for me. What are you saying? <laughs> chase some jacket potato, we can't find one. I'm gonna get a little food on, then we're gonna hit the road. I've gotta go and see one of my pals, discuss some merch and stuff like that. Bits and bobs, so I'm gonna go down and see him. He's got a fantastic dog, but let me tell you, this dog is massive. Yeah, we'll just keep the vlog rolling from there. Let's go. Imagine I've just spilled the whole whole juice down my pants, bro. Look at that, you see that, look. And the car man's walking, cuz. I filmed the thing. they need to take it in out. How man's coming out of the ting. Ah. Yes, yes, so as I told you lot, just stopped off to my mates to have a little meeting. I said to you, man, 
his dog is the big thing. So watch when you see this dog come out now, my boy Yogi, but watch when you see the size of him, bruv, in person, yeah? Different. <laughs> Yogi. <clears throat> Look at the size of man like Yogi, boy. <laughs> Look at the size of him, bruv. Protecting Kate. And, and, and how much is he weighing right now? Do you say about 85, 85 kg? Now, actually taking the arm, look. Now, I wanted to show the, the YouTube yogi, man, because <laughs> I don't think they understand. Do you know what I'm saying? Look at the size of him, though, man. Look at the size of this brother there. Look at the size of, man. Let me just do a comparison, yeah? Look. He's making me look like a patty, isn't it? Uh, so, yeah, he's 85 kg. Yeah. He's from Noxtera Burble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they're in um, Essex. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. that. OK. Um, he's, he is a one of one in the UK, for sure. Yep, yep, uh, yep. I'd say probably one of one in Europe. Yeah. Not many like him. OK, um, so so his stamp, his structure. The way he he's, looks, he's yeah. good looking. He's a good looking Burble as well. He comes under a, he, he's not a SABS registered. Yeah. He's a NABA registered. So okay. SABS is a South African breed. Registered, that's a South, South, like yeah. South African kennel club. That's it. And, and he like, is, so what is... North American, he's registered he's on NABA. NABA. Him and a pairing that was done with Noxterra. Yeah. They had the first ever chocolate. That's chocolate, before, full suit, isn't it? Yeah. Born in the UK. Okay, uh, we'll have to put a picture of the chocolate one up there. Yeah, so that's the first ever one that's been born in the UK. Where would you say the best ball balls are at right now? Um, the UK it doing it, the US doing it. America I'm saying I've seen what you've been doing, and you've yeah. been putting, you've been producing your socks off, unks, man. America, so yeah, America likes bigger. Okay, yeah, they rush with everything. Yeah, if you want, you want big, mass. Big, yeah. I personally think a functional one's a bit more better. Yeah. He's big, but yeah. he does. He does run, his thing. Yeah. We do his thing. We take yeah. Seven and 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 how much is he eating? He only eats one kg of raw day with a bit of kibble. So would you say his whole one daily, six. would you say like one, would you say his whole daily intake would be like 1.3 kg? If that. If that, 1.3 kg and he's running. He's naturally big. And he's so, big so would you say people are forcing size on dogs? I think in all dogs they try. They try and force size. Do you think if you no. overdone it, do you think he would, it, it would show in his, his sort of movement, his behavior, everything like that? Yeah, you'd see, he wouldn't be as good. Yeah. You know, they wouldn't be mm -hmm. as happy. Can't take them out, can't do walks with them. They'll yeah. be upset, they're not gonna enjoy it. I think uh, with all these dogs, it takes 18 months for their bone, bones to fuse. Okay, so, so 18 months really so just you shouldn't, you shouldn't wrapped in cotton wool. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if you try and get them too big, too quick to look the part, yeah. then you're only gonna damage them. Yeah, yeah. You look at only start putting on size when you got above two years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we started doing uphill, up, down. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So would you say when you own one of these dogs, patience? Yeah. Patience. Patience is key. Definitely. Yeah, you know, loads of things can happen. Mm -hmm. And they're big dogs. Yeah, 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 yeah. And what's it? So holding him on the lead when you're walking and stuff like that, has there been problems or is the grot like these are sort of instruments you need to have once you've got a dog you these sorts? Yeah, you, you have to be. Um, okay. You've got to have control. You've got to be spot on with them. You can't uh, slip up on your training. Mm -hmm. Training is, but with all dogs. Yeah, with everything. Training is. Dogs, they think they're trained, but they're not training them. Yeah. He's all right, he's good, he's getting there, but yeah, yeah, yeah. every dog can improve. That's it, every, everybody, and that's even in ourselves. That's Do you know it. what I'm saying? <laughs> well, listen, I ain't going to keep you too long, but I told you lot, Yogi the unit, make sure you lot follow the man, because as I said, this, this is the biggest dog I've seen in my life, and you know I've seen big dogs, yeah? All right, thanks for that, unks. No yes. Yes, 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 everybody. So I'm back at home now. Let me let these lot out. My little clean man. Come on and get down. Get down. <coughs> Told you, Bynes clean. It's only, it's only Dell's kennel that I've got to go and get shit out of, bro. What I'm going to do, because all the boxes of dog food that I get, I'm going to set up the bin, light a fire with all them boxes and stuff like that of the dog food. Look at this guy, how he moves. Bro, 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 bro. Bro, look at this brother there. He's gonna, he's gonna be big, man. Look at him, pisses like a little girl, bro. But he tries to act like such a bad man. Let me put these lot away now, and then, um, yeah, crap back on. Let's go. <laughs> no, lads. All right, my people. So we're gonna end the night now. The fire cracking. It's got a couple bits and pieces, all like the raw food boxes, bits of old wood to burn. So just gonna burn that down there now, and then yeah, get to bed. Tomorrow we got another busy one. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing a lot more of these day in the lives. So yes, like, comment, and subscribe. Let's go.